What's going on, you guys? This is Isaac Eubank, and this is The Morning Dump. I'm here with my co-host, the cardboard cutout, Jason Aldean, and the beautiful baby Brad Pitt, classing up the joint. We want to thank you guys for tuning in, and we're here to bring you guys the news. So, here it comes. Uh, a lot going on in the news, guys. A lot going on in the news. Let's see. Uh, heart transplant for United Airlines President Oscar Munoz. Must be nice to be rich, man. Fuck. I always said if I won the lotto, man, I'd fucking spend every penny to stay alive as long as I could to see if we go in the Star Trek direction or the Transformers direction or the X Machina fucking direction. I don't fucking know, but I want to see where we're going. Uh, so kudos to that guy, I guess. Um, let's see what else is going on. Uh, David Bowie died. Sad. Alan Rickman died. Sad. Uh, Dan Haggerty died. Sad. I mean, people die. I guess it's sad. You know, um, I don't think it's personally, you know, too sad. I mean, it's a journey we're on, right? Uh, and they're just on to the next portion of it. Um, I kind of, uh, you know, um, think that, you know, people, especially like them that have lived lives that they're leaving something behind, leaving a legacy behind. Those are full lives, in my opinion. So it's not really sad when people like that go. I mean, they did what they did. They made their mark. And um, they'll live, you know, forever or as long as uh, digital records, you know, allow. Uh, and they always say it happens in threes. Isn't that crazy, man? <clears throat> what is that with this whole threes thing and uh, famous people dying? Let's see. What else do we got going on? Man, some upsetting news. Tim Kennedy's being threatened by ISIS or ISIL or fucking, I like to call them Daesh fucking cowards. And, uh, but, uh, yeah, man, it's, it's, it's stupid. I mean, Tim Kennedy's a fucking, a living hero and also a fucking UFC superstar. The dude helps everybody he can. Uh, he's just a good guy, man, all around. And to have these fucking cowards threaten him, it really pisses me off. You know, uh, I'd like to see him try it, though. I mean, fuck. He's about the last dude I would think anybody would want to fuck with on this planet. So, good luck, you fucking cowards. Uh, Jessica Jones, man, it got uh, renewed on Netflix. That's fucking good news right there, man. That was a good show. I mean, that dirty bitch, man, could fight. She don't take showers. She don't like showers, but she likes whooping ass and drinking, so that's pretty fucking cool to watch, I guess. Um, Tony Hinchcliffe special came out this week. Um, One Shot. That was a fucking really good special on Netflix, man. It was just, uh, really, really well uh, done. I like the way that he did everything in one shot. It was a cool concept, and I... It was for me just like going to school, being a comedian myself, just being able to watch someone like him work. Um, you really, really learn a lot. And that was fun to watch. Tom Segura's Mostly Stories was fucking awesome as well. Another fucking, you know, um, day in school for me, man. It was awesome just watching Tom Segura tell his stories and just see how he just uh, kept the crowd's attention. It was beautiful. Fucking beautiful, you guys. If you haven't seen him. Check them out. Uh, you know, not not a lot more in the news going on, guys, that I'm, you know, wanting to talk about because I really don't give a fuck. I don't mind being uh, uninformed. It, it, it doesn't really uh, affect me that much at this point. I mean, the more I, I pay attention to the news, guys, to be honest, the more pissed off I get. And I don't like being pissed. I like being happy. So, you guys, uh, Let's stay happy. Let's stay healthy. Uh, let's keep working out. I've been working out, doing the weekly workout. You guys should check that out and join me. That'll help you guys out. Also, uh, I've got the um, Me and My Favorite African podcast. That shit's fun every Thursday at 8, so be sure to check that out. And Friday and Saturday, man, uh, this week at Tacos and Torches Adrian's, I have a comedy show coming. So come check us out, guys. It's going to be a great time. I want to thank Happy Thrift on Facebook and eBay. Also... Comedy Scene in Texas on Facebook, where I post all my shows, and flirty30s.com, where girls are live waiting to talk to you right now as we speak. You guys, it's been great. This is your news for the week. Peace.